Long ago, but perhaps not too far, a kingdom of crescent and double star was ruled with strength, heart, and wisdom unseen by monarch beloved, the gold-haired good queen. Always close, right by her throne, was the little princess, Syok, hardly ever seen alone, where mom went, daughter would walk. Yet soon would end the time of peace. Ill news came from the frontier. The phoenix, an ancient beast, brought to flames all that came near. Queen said, my dear, you must understand. I have to leave to a distant land to fight for you and all I hold dear. But in her heart, the princess felt fear. Leading an army, away the queen rides. All pray for her quick return, besides one who would in the castle remain to use the Queen's absence for his own gain. The royal wizard, burned by ambition, has sworn with evil forces coalition to realize his sinister plan to rule the minds of all women and men. Set upon the highest tower, the wizard unleashed his power. The sky went black with clouds of storm. The castle began to transform. Hours once bright became dark as night. From walls and floors broken crawled horrors unspoken. The vile wizard and his minions over castle gained dominion. The princess bravely fought, she eventually too was caught. To the dungeon, take her! A prisoner, make her! Keep her there and lock the door! I cannot be interfered, said the mage and disappeared. What he didn't know is more will be needed than one lock to get rid of Princess Tsiok.